Hai. Hai. Look, um, there is something I must tell you. Okay. I know you cannot wait to have a taste of me. Honestly, I can't wait. You're so beautiful. Got you sexy, banging, everything. But I have a challenge. Okay. I have never cheated on my wife before. You're going to be the first. And you are her best friend. I don't want to look into your eyes when I do it. Can, can you at least blindfold yourself? I don't want to look into your eyes. Neither do I want you to look into my eyes. Please. Why? I already told you. This is going to be the first time I'm cheating on my wife. I will feel so guilty. I don't want to see you. I don't want to see your eyes. But that's weird. I know, but that's the only thing I'm asking all right, for. All right. Just okay. the only thing standing in between us okay. getting down. I'll get a blindfold. You get a blindfold? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Blindfold. Go yeah. get it. Why is it taking long? What are you doing? See, see. I've allowed you to do what you want to do, okay? So now it's my turn, please. Uh -uh. Because when I start now, I'm not going to stop to see we're both on this bed. So now it's my turn. Jessica, you're supposed to be my best friend. I would never believe you would try to sleep with my husband. You set me up, you idiot. Huh? You know when my husband told me you were trying to seduce him? I didn't believe him. Because I trusted you. Hmm. Well, now you should believe him. Now you should believe him. What? Tasha! I was supposed to be your friend. Huh? Well, listen. I wanted you to have a taste of the pain I went through. I wanted you to have a taste of, of, of how it feels for a man to, to betray you. So because you have a man, you think you're perfect? You think both of you are perfect human beings? Oh, Tata, I was supposed to be your friend, right? And you were supposed to console me at every given grieving moment. But what did you do? You were callousing, flaunting your husband's perfection in my eyes. What are you talking about? <laughs> okay. Let me jog your memory. Let me help you remember. Tacha, on my supposed wedding day, when you came to my house, after my ex dumped me at the altar, what did you do? Hmm? You came to my house. Instead of you to console me, you told me to get a man like Davis. And then I accepted. So what's this drama all about? Oh huh? God. Jessica, you are unbelievable. Babe, you know what? Let's get out of here. Huh? Jessica. Let's get out of here. Get out of my house! Would you shut up? Get out! We're leaving already. Get out! Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Nonsense! Get out! Get out of my house! If you men that they think, now we want to talk! Even you that she gives morning in the morning, afternoon, evening, you want to talk! You want to talk? You want to talk? Nonsense! Rubbish! Jessica, what happened? What happened? 
happen? The, 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 the pastor told us that the wedding has been, has been cancelled. We're all seated in the hall. He just called me on the phone and broke up with me. He said he's not going to marry me again. I don't know. What? Is he okay? I don't know. Man, when he was talking to me, he said he's on his way to the US already with another woman. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What do I do? Jessica. And then he took all of my money, everything. All oh, your money? Hey, Jessica, no now. Why would you do a thing like that? Why would you, why would you give him access to all your money? Eh? Why, girls? We need to learn. We need to really learn. I told you. I told you about that guy. You should have just been patient. You should have been patient and then you would probably have gotten a guy as great as Dave is here. Look at who I call a bestie. Have you been waiting for an opportunity to mock me or what? You would rather judge me than console me. Listen, I know all men cheat. Oh. Men are scum. But, but some men are not scum. This man seated here is not a scum. He will never cheat on you. He's a good man. He is not. And I just hope you find a man as good as he is. That's the kind of person I want for you. Not some, some riffraff that will run away with your money, break your heart and make you shed tears. Hey! Challenge accepted. I will see how faithful your sense of a husband is. And for mocking me, I will make sure you feel the pain I am going through right now. Oh, don't cry. It's okay. Tasha, do you know you talk too much, right? Hmm? At this point, I need company, right? Um, okay, so, can I come spend a few days in your house. David's one of mine, right? Of course. You need somewhere to, to, to get yourself together. You need to leave this place. If going to a different space would help, then why not? Oh, sorry. See how this man just ruined today for you. I'm so sorry. Don't cry. Don't cry. So sorry, yeah? Don't cry. I'm so sorry. Ah, man. Man, you guys are scum. Aren't this beautiful? Huh? Well, I bet they are still very soft and succulent. Do you want to touch it? Huh? Um, well, you know I'm such a vibe that every man wants to be with me. And then I used to give that idiot a head. Well, I, I wouldn't know. Mm, yeah, so I don't feel to do that, especially that morning at Rosa. You know, that thing that proves a real man. Actually, a jerk, but I'm not really a very good relationship counselor. Okay, I think you should wait for Tasha, your friend. She's she's a guru. She she'll be able to counsel you better. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <sighs> it 
If my words can kickstart your jiggy man, then oh la la, I'll have less work to do, obviously. <laughs> <coughs> Trying to work. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. wasn't sitting properly on my chest. Um, I, was, well, I was going to ask, uh, is the top rushing now? Because um, I need to have a bath. Uh, yes, 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 yes. The, the, the water is running now. Okay. Your friend fell down. Baby. What is it again? What do you want? Um. Would you be kind enough to give me a body massage? Um, my my body, my back, my waist aches from the fall I had yesterday. <sighs> you you have body pains. You want a massage, huh? All right, just give me a second. <clears throat> So that would do. Open it, you find an ointment inside, apply it to the affected area, and then you feel relief ASAP. Hmm? What kind of a man is this? <clears throat> um, um. <laughs> the, what was your problem? Can you hear my heart? I can't hear anything. Ah. <laughs> Listen, I'm having a panic attack. I need some cuddling to keep me calm. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, okay. I'm stepping out. Would you like to come with me? No, no. I need some more rest. Yeah, Pele. Yeah. But in case you get bored, just call me. Hmm? All right. All There's right. food in the fridge. Eat as you like. Chop this life. <laughs> okay. Don't worry about my husband. He'll take care of himself. All right. All right. All right. See you soon. Yeah, all right. Bye. Take care. <laughs>
Hi, sleepyhead. I'm sorry, I'm still tipsy from last night. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't mention, you don't even need to mention it. I mean, when your missus forgot to give her husband breakfast before leaving to work. Well, well, I was the one that actually asked her to scratch all those within because um, she's okay. very, very occupied and busy. Okay, now I'm here. She don't have to starve anymore. Hmm? Um. Uh, so, is anyone excited to have me around? Hello, Jigga boy. Hey. Um, I just got up, okay? Uh, I need some time to get into the activities of the day. Okay. I don't mind if you just leave, so I'll, I'll do what I have to do. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. But I'll be back, okay? Just go first, please. Mm. Babe? Yep. Um, I think the breakup your friend experienced is really affecting her mentally. What do you mean? I don't know, boy. If you ask me, I think she should get a therapy. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know, boy. If you ask me, I think one or two sessions of therapy won't be bad. <laughs> what Come for? on. Baby, it's not funny. <laughs> it's not funny. She's been acting, I don't know. There's something wrong with her psychologically. Listen, babe. Jessica is a strong woman, okay? I mean, I know the heartbreak might be getting to her, but she'll be fine. All right? How does she think? Okay. What are you pointing at? Well, uh... I... What am I even saying? Maybe what I'm saying is she needs encouragement. Just encourage her. Tell her that she's going to be fine. She's going to be all right. Her dream man is going to work by pretty soon. I mean, one of these days. Baby, you're not making sense, I swear. <laughs> what do you even say? Huh? Yeah. You're not saying anything again. Yeah, I was thinking, speaking of therapy, we should actually go to the spa, you know? Now, baby? Are you sure? <laughs> Stop. I could just pull back my jewelries, no, no, babe. No. Yes. I'm, I'm still thinking about it. I've not really. You know, know I'm anything. always ready. Ever ready for you. Okay, let me just wear back my jewelries. <laughs> <laughs> That's not. Now I see what her magic is. Tasha is loyal and submissive to her husband, even with her finances. I am very sure it's loyalty and submissiveness that is keeping Davis. Yes, that is what gives birth to his own loyalty and commitment. I knew it. I knew that his faithfulness is fake. If he sees a woman that showers him and treats him more than Tasha, he's definitely going to shift ground. <laughs> I'll be Nigerian man when I know again. <laughs> hmm. Now I know what to do. I know exactly what to do. Problem. What's the problem? No. Where I come from, it's a taboo for a married man to be washing his clothes when there's a woman in the house. Eh? Well, your village people are not my village people. Even though, even though. Ha. See, I'm an African woman who has moral values and uphold our culture. 
So, ah, no, 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 I can't just be looking at you to wash these clothes now. Don't worry, let me wait, wait, wait. Let me I, get... Come on, I can do this. I mean, I appreciate the fact that you're an African woman and that's beautiful. And I appreciate the fact that you want to uphold the culture. But I got this. It's nothing. There's nothing here. Wait now. If Tasha will allow you to do this, I mean, wash your own clothes. Me, I will not let you do that. Eh? She's supposed to know that this is the responsibility of a woman. This is our responsibility to wash your clothes and cook for you to eat. Eh? Please, what's wrong with my friend? Ah! Really, you should leave Tasha out of this, okay? Tasha is a very busy woman. She's a career woman. She's working. I, I don't let her stress herself with stuff like this when I, when I can do it. No, oh, come on. Irrespective of that, Davis. Hmm? If Tasha was properly trained, I mean properly trained by a Nigerian mother, she will know that she needs to take care of her man, her home, before stepping out of the house in the morning to go anywhere. Hmm? She's supposed to know that. Mm. And now, maybe because she's the breadwinner of the family now, she's the one that will go out, make money and come, then she will cook rubbish for you to eat as if you are a dog. Eh? Please. <laughs> oh, babe. Look at my baby. You go back so early. Mm. Mm. My How baby. are you? I'm Gucci, baby. Go back so early today. I didn't have so much to do. Uh, Did you miss me? Well, just a little bit. Shut up. <laughs> so <hard> to me. <laughs> I missed you much. <laughs> hey, Jesse. Hi, Tasha. Hi. Hey, yeah, you're back. Yes. I'm back. You needed to have seen what happened today. Hey, Jesus Christ. On my way coming, one guy was busy. Oh, um, I'm in the mood. Uh, I'll be in my room. Ah, okay. Babe, you needed to have seen. One guy was looking at one girl. Okay. Big and massive behind. Mado. And then he was causing traffic. That behind is called Ikebe. This fool. So after all I said about this babe earlier, he could still love her with her like this. He's definitely not moved by any of those words. Wow. Just wow. know someone else eating. Okay, let me see one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, eating fufu <laughs> and pounded yam. Shut up. Miss sweets, a burrito. Bro, yeah. that girl is really haunting me like a hungry dog. <sighs> is the situation that bad? Maybe you should just tell your wife. Bro, I've tried, but it's not working. What do you mean it's not working? I've tried on several occasions <laughs> to point out all these things to my wife. But she's acting totally blind to all of them. She's not even seeing the girl's funny, funny movements around me. Maybe it's you she's just trusting, you know. She's probably seen all these things, but just trusting you not to fall. Do you understand? Uh-uh. I don't think it's me, man. I think my wife is totally blinded by trust. The trust she has for that girl. That's what's up. Or do you think this is some type of game? You know these girls can be fond of doing these kind of things to gain confidence in their man. Don't you think so? Mm -mm. The situation here is that that girl wants to get down with me, and that's what's up. Oh, oh wow. Then if that's the case, you have to tell Tasha. You have to tell your wife. <sighs> Except you want to chop and clean mouth. God forbid. Married now. Yeah, I know you now. I know you. you can't be doing that kind of thing. Man. Ma'am, I'm famished. Let's just go get something to eat. I feel like hungry. So, everything all right? Babe. <clears throat> I've been thinking. Thinking about what? I think you need to get a job. I need to get a job. What do you mean? I've got a job. No. I mean like, 
like a real job, a proper physical job. I don't get it. My job is not proper. No. My job is fake. You said a real job. What do you mean? It's not proper. Listen, I needed to get a proper job and earn a living like every other man. All right, this online thing you do is for people with no proper certification. Come on. I thought you were intelligent. I mean, if I didn't know you, I would probably think you didn't go to school. Because forex trade is what you're calling an improper job. Working online, doing digital marketing and stuff like that, that's good and fine. Babe, you and I should know that whether it's a physical job or it's an online job, a job is a job, all right? A job is a job. Most people don't even prefer a nine to fives anymore. Some people prefer to, you know, go for people that are, that are very, very flexible, freelancers. Mm. I know I may not be earning so much, but I've got a plan, and my job is good with time. I can build, I can get, I can expand, so you don't have to, you know? No, I don't belong to that school of thought. I need you to go out. I need to come back home and discuss work with my husband. I don't need you staying at home morning till night. You're not the woman. Excuse me? That's the way it is. Were well, you talking to me like that, for real? You heard me. You're talking to me like that because I am, I'm working online because I'm not earning as much as you do, right? <sighs> Thought you had something better. You're standing here like a mannequin and you're just thinking about me getting a job. While I have a job, yes, I know I can do better. I know I can get a better job. I know, but you don't have to rub it on my- Get a job! It's not that difficult, all right? I'm tired. Sent him enough pictures already. Mm. By now, he should be hungry for me. And I'll be waiting right here. Because I know he can't resist this charm. I'll be waiting. But baby, you've always loved my job. I remember you used to tell me to try trading on bigger platforms and get more investors. So what changed? Babe, the thing is, if you don't get a proper job, people will think you're jobless. I mean, you just wake up in the morning, you do nothing, you just stay at home all day. Somehow now. Wait, 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 wait. wait. So it's, oh gosh. So it's, you even, it's for the people, huh? the heck babe look if you ask me i don't want to talk about this anymore this whole job talk is really pissing me off you're doing it for the people not even for some reasonable thing i was wondering it's not just for the people then for what for me as well you you've never had a problem with it but now i have a problem then something changed what is it nothing changed i already gave you my reason <sighs> my phone is i don't know who's my phone is beeping And someone's texting. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. <sighs> you want to sleep, right? Mm-hmm. Mm, just go to bed. Um, mm -hmm. I want to go downstairs and just stroll, stroll around. All right. All right, boo. Uh, good night. Good night, my love. Let me. Talk you in. No good night, Pat. Oh, why not? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's okay. Mm -hmm. Get out. All right, I'm coming, yeah? Yeah. This rubbish has to end.
Oh. Look who came running at the sight of my boobs and tie. Yeah, you even forgot your manners and didn't knock. Jessica. Jessica, you are very sick. And I think you need to seek help. Because mm. you've lost your mind. Oh, okay. So tell me. Did you come here to tell me this or you came to be my remedy? Huh? Hey, come listen come to me! Come listen to me. Listen to me and listen good. You need help. You have lost your mind. If you continue this bullshit, I'm going to have no option than to tell my wife all you've been doing. Do you understand? Okay. Alright. So are you going to do that? Huh? Do you want to tell your wife? Tell your wife what exactly? Huh? What do you want to tell your wife? Stop! Stop! Listen. The only reason I'm making an excuse for you is because I know you're traumatized. Don't try this nonsense again. Then heal me. Huh? Heal me. Heal me. No! Stop this! No. Nearly will soon kill the bed. How do I get this guy? As beautiful as I am, he could resist me. No man has ever been able to resist me. I give you kudos, Davis, but this makes me want you even more. Your type is rare. I won't let go nor leave this house until I successfully get laid by you, dear Davis. High time she left. Babe, why are you so mean? She needs us. We need our privacy. We need our lives intact, don't we? She's not disrupting anything. Is that what you think? Davis, this is my friend. And she needs us so much right now. We can't turn our backs on her. Babe, we have tried. Two whole weeks. She's been here for two weeks. That's a lot. This is meant to be a home between a married couple. Don't you get it? She has a house. She can go to a house. If she doesn't want to stay in a house, she has a family. She can go and stay with her family. That's my point. Wow. Really, babe? But she saw her family members before she decided to come stay with us. Listen, my love, she is hurting and, and, and trying to heal. Please. Baby. Do you expect me to send her away? You want me to throw her bags outside? I can't do that. This lady needs us right now. Please. Fine. I have to go to work. I don't want to be late. See you when I get back, okay? <laughs> you win. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Hello, babe. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, the thing is, I can't send it now with my account. The token, whatever. What I'll do, I'll just stop by at the POS store and do it for you. Alright. 
I've heard you, I beg. Bye bye. <laughs> Tasha. Hmm. A call that a woman is supposed to be putting through to a man is the call your husband is making. Jesse, come on, don't get it twisted. He's my husband and sometimes I support him, I assist him sometimes. I mean, Yes, I understand that part, but that is when he is truly the head of the family. Ha. But not this your unclassified husband who sits and waits for you to bring money all the time. Jesse. We've talked about it, all right? And we've agreed that he's going to get a job. Oh. He's going to get something. Yeah, that's why you're encouraging his laziness for now. How am I encouraging his laziness? Stop giving him anything. Not this small, small. Stop giving him money. Let him go and look for money. Come on now. Let him work. It's fine. Huh? I've heard you. We've talked about it. And I'm sure he's going to do something about it. Well, well don't forget you're dropping me off at the supermarket. No problem. And also, you said you were going to do transfer for the cosmetic and toiletries. Please, do it now. Jesse, I've heard you. In fact, let me do it now so I can breathe. All right. This girl is on your neck and you, you still can't tell your wife. How do you expect me to tell her? <laughs> Baby, your friend is seducing me. <laughs> Oh, you see, you're laughing. You're laughing. That's, be that's because it sounds funny. It sounds weird. Oh my God. But on the more serious note, you need to tell her. Or at least make her understand what is going on. You're right. Because, bro, this is not good for your marriage. Do you understand? I feel you. You yeah. understand. The only challenge is that it's not as easy as it looks. It's very easy to advise from afar, but if you were in my shoes, bro, you, you don't know what to do. Trust me. I think I need to see this lady in question. Let me even see what's given her the confidence that she has. Make her see who the torments this your life like this guy. I know why you want to see her. She's beautiful. She's not just beautiful. Really? She's well endowed. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's her business anyway. It's not mine. Bro! Who grew up with this babe now? Really? At least let me be like a distraction. Do you understand? Immediately you she has a banging body. You want to be distracted? Yeah, hook me up. At least let me just divert her attention kind of thing now. Uncle but that, that's actually a good idea anyway. So, I mean, yeah, yeah. Uh, we should work on that. I mean, at this point, anything that's just gonna get her off my back, I'm down. We should do that. I know, right? She's in doubt. What kind of nonsense is this?
These guys tried to drive me crazy today. I literally had a very hot with Kasha and that crazy friend. That crazy friend went to wash my undies. I owned my undies. Ha! I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with that girl, but however, because of Tasha, I'm trying to respect Tasha. I made sure that I give the, the whole unleashing to Tasha herself. She was the one that collected the whole package. Guy, I was too mad to do that. I was too mad to start explaining everything. Slapping some sense into Tasha. Honestly, you, you know me very well. I'm a very calm guy, but why would Tasha be so naive? She's literally very naive. She, she, she's, she's acting like she doesn't have sense. Very careless and callous with her man. She literally trusts that girl so much. She even trusts her more than the way she trusts me. Can you imagine? Guy, today, that girl's in my house. Tasha, see, I don't blame him. If not because that I'm a good friend and, and I don't want to cause trouble in your home, I would have insulted him. I would have insulted him. Because, because he said no. Look, look at the way he, he was just throwing tantrums at me. Just, just, just misbehaving. Do you think it's because he asked for money and I didn't give him? Oh. My dear, you cannot count on a broke man's loyalty. You can't. Obviously, it's because you didn't give him money. Yes. No. Trust me. I know you won't believe me, but you need to test his loyalty. But because with the, with the look of things, my dear, you are the man and at the same time the woman in this marriage. Open your eyes. Shine it. Open it. But, but that can't be true. I mean, my husband loves me. Tasha, love you because of what? Eh, hey, Tasha? See, you can't count on a broke man's love until you test his loyalty. Eh? Maybe you have to stop showing him all this small, small support that you are showing him. So that the beast in him will come out and you will see it crawling out with a horn. Well, in as much as I love and trust my husband. Oh, I think you have a point. Hey. I mean, this is the first time I'm refusing to give him something and, and, and I came home to that. Hey. Now you can judge for yourself. You can judge for yourself. Just one no. Maybe if you had given it to him, you would have returned home to a happy and loving husband. But one small no like this reverses the case. He wants to eat you up. Hey, Open your eyes, oh my dear. Shine your eyes. Shine it. I know what to yeah. do. I will push him. I will, I will so push him till the beast in him comes out. <laughs> no, baby. You will push him till he come running into my waiting arms. <laughs> How can he do that to me? How can he talk to me like this? I'm laboring for the both of us and he's disrespecting Aww. me. Ah, Oshie Libora. Bele, we're done. Ah. Me.
should I just apologize? Huh. But if I do, she's not going to learn. I need her to realize she's giving Jessica too much room and that's what's giving her access to me. Yes. I need her to see that. Oh, I miss cuddling my husband. Should I apologize to him so we can have our peace back? I know he's hurting too. But if I apologize to him, how do I test his loyalty as Jessica suggested? I think I should listen to Jessica because it's obvious the reason for his anger isn't just because Jessica washed his undies. All of this is because of the money I didn't give to him. And I think I should just watch it. My God, I thank you. My eyes are becoming open now. How did I fall for this lazy cow? I'm getting ready for work and here he is, sleeping. And then I come back and I feed him with my hard-earned money. Only for him to rant and pose as a man. Tasha, are you still mad at me? Huh? Plus, I should leave for work without saying a word. Today is the deadline of that program. What am I going to do? I need to pay. Bob is my last resort. Let me see if I can call him. I'm not in the mood for this right now, Jessica. Oh. Okay? Please. I know. Hmm? That is why I'm here to make you feel better. Okay, um, first, let me apologize. Um, well, I'm sorry for making you and Tasha quarrel last night. It's not as if I intentionally washed your hundies. I I just wanted to help out. I'm sorry. All right, fine. Apology accepted. Okay. So tell me, why are you tensed and stressed? Well, I'm looking for money to do something very important. I need to pay for a very important <sighs> online course and I'm not able to cash out for my Forex accounts. And I have okay. a deadline. That's why my face is like this. Okay, so how much are we talking about? Mm -hmm. Hundred and twenty thousand naira. Hundred and twenty thousand. Come on, that's change. Come off it. <laughs> that's change. Hundred and twenty thousand. I'll send you the money right away. Wow. 
Yeah. Well, I, Jessica, I really appreciate this. I promise I will pay you back as soon as I'm able to. Thank you very much. You don't need to pay me back. See, you don't need to thank me. Mm? Just consider this a gift from me to you. Mm? Thank you. All right, what's your account? Six one. Mm -hmm. Four two. Mm -hmm. Six eight. Mm -hmm. Zero zero five four. Okay. Well, bank. Access. Okay. All right, and. Wow. Come on. 120k is nothing. I know, but I, I, this, this came very. T Let me rush and pay it. All right. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is a very good opportunity. I will save his account number in my beneficiary list. After now, I will be sending him money from time to time. Mm. Babe, you're back already. Yes, I am. Um, babe, do you mind coming upstairs? Let's have a chit chat. No, I don't want to talk to you. As a matter of fact, I don't want to say anything to you until you apologize to Jessica. <laughs> babe, really? Is that what you're telling me? Look, if you're still angry because I cautioned your friend for washing my own dish, and then I told you you're being very nonchalant about salient issues, I mean, go to anybody that is reasonable and tell them that your husband is angry because your friend washed his own dish, and then you are okay with it and expect him to clap for you. Let him clap for you. I don't understand you. What's going on? What's up with you? Davis, you were disrespectful, all right? Do you know what Jessica's been through? Do you know what she's going through right now? She go here because she wants to have peace. She wants to be happy and you're trying to make life miserable for her. Listen, I, I didn't know you're this way. As a matter of fact, I've never seen this version of you. What is going on? Babe, for real, you're talking to me this way? Well, Davis, all I did was to innocently wash your undies. I mean, I was already doing laundry anyways. So personally, I don't see anything wrong in washing your undies. Except maybe you have a dirty mind. Or you have something very dirty in your mind. God. So you're leaving without apologizing to her? To hell with that apology. To hell with you too. To hell with me. You heard me. You see why I told you to be more diplomatic about this? Because, bro, fear women when it comes to turning matters around. Exactly. That was exactly what happened. And when it happened, I remembered your advice immediately. But the thing is, why, why is she doing this anyway? Did Tasha snatch any of her man in the past or something? No, no, no. Tasha cannot do that. Trust me. Tasha is too down to earth and calm to do that. Huh? I, I think she's on a mission to destroy your marriage. <sighs> Bruh. That's the reality. And it's so sad that my wife is too blind and naive to see that. Sorry, but I don't understand what Jessica is doing, man. I don't understand why she's doing what she's doing. I think Jessica is traumatized, and I understand that she needs a man. But definitely, I am not that man. 
I can never be that man. I'm married and I love my wife. Bro, you need to be very careful. Honestly. You need to just try and plan a way to make Tasha catch her. Mm. Or, or you just go with the flow and make them, you know, catch you red-handed or something. Catch me red-handed. Hey, guy, if that happens, I'm sure Jessica is going to put it on me. And it will shock you that Tasha will believe her. That's true, Sharon. don't want to do that. That's true, that's true, that's true. Okay, you know what, you know what will happen? Hook me up with her, just as we discussed the other time. Abby? Yeah, hook me up with her. I've been thinking about it though, guy. That would be the solution, oh. Yeah. I, I need you to distract her. That's what we're gonna do. It's important. Mm. Alright. Just, just do that. Sure. Yeah. So sure, let's just try. Let's just go grab a drink. Hmm. Wow. It's unbelievable how these love beds are already against each other so fast. And very soon. I am going to make Tasha a furniture in her own house. Yeah, who is it coming? Mm. Babe. Yeah. Have fun. Um, I want to talk to you about something. Do you think I was too harsh on him? Of course no. As a matter of fact, you are even too soft and understanding. Eh? Well, it's your nature, Sha. You know, but you're still on the right track. Mm. Yeah. Are you sure? Of course. Well, me, I fired back at him because this is how they start, start giving silly excuses to, to cover up for their stupidity. So, ah, mm. me, I fired him. Oh. Anyways, I'm so sorry. Sorry for all of that. Please. It's fine. I understand. I just had to come talk to you before going to bed. Thank you. Oh, yeah, now. Let me let you sleep. Good night. All right. Good night. See you. Yeah. Sorry. I am really sorry. I'm tired of fighting with you. I missed you. I take responsibility for everything. And look, I'll never yell at you again. If there's something we can talk about, we'll talk about it. Please, love. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Trent. You have no idea. But I have really missed you. Really? Sure. <laughs> missed you too. <laughs> Why are you smiling? So you missed me? Mm hmm I thought you didn't. Oh, I did. Just a little bit. Just a little. Little is something. <laughs> you know what? The boy got to go shower right now. Come join the girl. Okay, boy. On the bed. Okay, boy. Has boy had anything to eat? Well, boy has not eaten for three days because boy's wife has not given him anything to eat. <laughs> well, boy's wife has forgiven boy, so she will make him something to eat. <laughs> really? But did boy's wife tell you that for sure? Maybe. <laughs> I'll go make you something to eat, all right? Gosh, I missed this for three days. I'll go make you something to eat. Alright. And then I'll see the stuff you made of. I I'll go shower so that I can make you something to eat. Yeah. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be right back, baby. <laughs> You've not called me that in some days now, you know. Shut up.
Uh -uh. What are you doing? I'm making noodles. Davis got back home, so I want to make it for him. Oh, you're making noodles for Davis. Just like that. Oh, true. He apologized and I forgave him. Huh? Tasha. This reconciliation is too soon now. What is this? Hey, you forgive him too soon. Can't you just hold something? Can't you, can't you just be, be angry for at least? Ta Tasha, calm down. Listen, Davis is actually a sweet guy. He, he's, he's a great man. We've actually not stayed in this house for one full day without talking to each other. Talk more of three days. Well, I'm happy we made up. I'm happy about it. <sighs> I hope you know what you're doing. Because it's because of this easy forgiveness that he will do whatever he wants to do and he will forgive him. That's why he's taking advantage of you. <laughs> Jessica, when you fall in love, eh? When you meet a man that you love, that loves you, mm. you will not go a day without talking to him. See, if you guys have issues, eh? I don't want this kind of love. Because this one, now Mumu love. Mumu love. It's my husband now. Because it can't be like say it's because of you God said forgive and forget. Small verse you cannot verse for long. Don't worry, when you when you fall in love. I beg you. Mm. I'll be the one to remind you. I will remind you. <laughs> hmm. Tasha. This girl must really be showing this guy love, too much love. Okay. Let's see if this her beloved husband will stand in fidelity stories. My love. I'm not trying to come in between you and your friend. I think it's high time she left. Why do you want her to leave? Is it not obvious that she's a bad influence? And then look, I must <clears throat> tell you this. Your friend. Your friend has been trying to seduce me. How? <clears throat> Listen, Jessica is a very playful person. I hope you're not mistaking it with flirting. Tasha, <laughs> I'm not a kid. I know what I'm saying. Listen, babe. <clears throat> Jessica is my friend. All right? She's crazy. She does crazy stuff. But seducing my husband? Snatching my husband? Nah, that's not Jessica. Come on. She would never do a thing like that. Huh? All right. Please, do me the favor of just finding a way to ask her to go. I know she needs someone. She needs a shoulder to cry on. She's going through heartbreak and all that. But at least... Look for another reason. Just find something, even if you don't want to make her feel bad. Please, let her just go. Okay. Yes, sir. I'll find a way to discharge her if that makes you happy. Surely does. Please do. <laughs> I just hope you're not mistaking her playful nature. Okay, sorry. <clears throat> Eat your food. All right? Okay. There we go. Mm -hmm. Good boy. <laughs> Play about everything. Are you not my baby boy anymore? Mm -hmm. You want some more? Mm -mm. Have some more. Eat for me, baby. After she's gone. Eat for me. She would go. We already talked about it. Don't ruin the mood. <laughs> she's gonna go. <laughs> 
Oh, baby, hold on, baby. It's calling you from up. Okay. Hold on. Please, can I get your ATM card? I need to do one or two things. What do you need it for? I'm trying to get something online. My, I can't find my card. Let me just pay for something. I'll reimburse you. Is, is that why you made up with me last night? Because you need money? Really? Is this what this marriage is about? Babe. What you can get from me? What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't have money. I can't give you my card, okay? Babe, mm. listen. Please. Tasha! Really? I should just send him the money, right? Since I'm already out. I guess he needs the money for the program. It's probably important. <sighs> On a second thought, I think I should just experiment what Jessica is saying. I know I love him and I trust him, but then I... I should just experiment and see what happens. That's what I should do. Jessica, what are you doing here? Oh, sorry, my bad. Never mind. Um, so I you said we were going to hang out today. Yeah. Yeah, so I came to find out for a time so that I don't keep you waiting trying to look good for you. That will be in the evening. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Um, I'm just in boxers and I need to go shower, so um I appreciate if you can just give me some time. Well, it's not as if I'm going to rape you. Huh? Yeah. Mm. <sighs> okay. I'm waiting for you. Should I come help you scrub your back? What's the meaning of this? What are you still doing here? Well, I wanted to feel the wetness of your skin. Jessica. Huh? Jessica, stop. Stop this. Stop. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Listen, I know you want me to, okay? Tell me. Do you want a head or a bite? Stop this thing, Jessica. Just stop. Stop this nonsense. Listen to me. No matter what you do, I'm not going to cheat on my wife with you. Do you understand? Okay. There is. You're just a tamed dog. Well, I know you might be uncomfortable in this environment. So I'll let you be for now. Huh? We're just shaking, shaking. Huh? Leave, leave. You're making me uncomfortable. Just go and I, I, I need to freshen up. Okay, so I was just going to ask, are we still hanging out tonight? Yes, this evening. Okay. Leave now! Where's my... Just, just that dress. Oh, let me help you. <laughs> Look 
that who is going to be a daddy. Congratulations. Ah, ah. But why didn't you guys tell me now? Ah, ah. You should have just given me this news now. <laughs> Congrats. Congrats for what? You're having a child. You're about to be a father. That's a lie. Uh, why are you shocked? Is this not your bedroom? Oh, my friend. Maybe she forgot to dispose it while in a hurry to get to work. Mm. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my bad, my bad. I forgot you're sterile. You can't father a child. Oh. Wait. Does that mean my friend is cheating on her husband? <sighs> well, you see, I can help you clear your head. Yeah, absolutely. We're hanging out tonight, so I can be your consolation space. Huh? Mm. Just leave. Leave. Okay, of course. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, my phone. I'm sorry. <laughs> See ya. We're tired of this marriage. You should have let me know. Then all this your attitude. It's it's very appalling. What are you talking about? What am I talking about? Congratulations. Congratulations, Tasha. But if you needed a baby so badly, you should have at least told me. Would have gone through the other route, would have would have done adoption or get a sperm donor. You didn't have to do it behind my back. This was what we agreed before we got married. What are you saying? What baby? I'm lost. I don't get it. You're lost. Davis! What is this? I don't get it. Davis, did you use this on yourself? It's meant for women. Sorry, was that my husband? Yes, he's the one. Who again is inside that car with him? Your friend, of course. My friend is in the car? Yes. She's there. How can my friend be in my husband's car when we just, we just had issues? Guy, what's up now? Good, 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 good. Keep leaving, guy. Okay? Sorry, man. Uh, this is Jess, my wife's very good friend. Jessica, my best friend, Bobby. Hello, Jess. I thought it was supposed to be just us. 
I'm down. Just come down. What do you mean, come down? I'm down. Yes, you guys. I must confess. I'm so good. Very good. Uh, guys, let's go grab some drinks inside. Let's go, let's go inside. Hey guy, what's up now? Stop now, stop. you guys go to? Davis, I am talking to you. Davis, I'm asking you, where did you guys go? Talking about relaxation. Mm. Well, I think my house is the best place for us to go. Yeah. Mm, your house? Mm -hmm. So that you won't say somebody's going to bump into us, this one is going to bump uh -huh. into us. Let's do your house then. All right. <laughs> we, we just just calm down, all right? Yeah, See, look, I like lots of foreplay and um, uh, yes, um, romance. You understand? Uh, but, but just take it easy. Take all the time. Mm -hmm. all right? Oh yeah. And when we look, this place smells kind of dusty. You've not been here in a long time, so I think we should just do a little clean up so we can breathe fresh air. All right. I so, so we we'll enjoy ourselves very well. Well, I'll give you a memory you will never forget. I believe you. Mm. I'll be right back. Alright, but so so just maybe get a broom and pack or something. Alright. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Okay. I'll be right back. Alright. Get, get a long broom. There's a cobweb here. Hey. Hey. Look, um, there is something I must tell you. Okay. I know you cannot wait to have a taste of me. Honestly, I can't wait. You're so beautiful. Look at you, sexy, banging, everything. But I have a challenge. Okay. I have never cheated on my wife before. You're going to be the first, and you are her best friend. I don't want to look into your eyes when I do it. Can, can you at least blindfold yourself? I don't want to look into your eyes. Neither do I want you to look into my eyes. Please. Why? I already told you. This is going to be the first time I'm cheating on my wife. I will feel so guilty. I don't want to see you. I don't want to see your eyes. But that's weird. I know, but that's the only thing I'm asking for. All right, for. all right. Just okay. the only thing standing in between us getting okay. down. I'll get a blindfold. You get a blindfold? Mm -hmm. Awesome. <sighs> blindfold. Go get it. Why is it taking long? What are you doing? See, see. I've allowed you to do what you want to do, okay? 
So now it's my turn, please. Ah, uh -uh. because when I start now, I'm not going to stop till we're both on this bed. So now it's my turn. Jessica, you're supposed to be my best friend. I would never believe you would try to sleep with my husband. You set me up, you idiot. Huh? You know, when my husband told me you were trying to seduce him, I didn't believe him because I trusted you. Hmm. Well, now you should believe him. Now you should believe him. What? Kasha, I was supposed to be your friend. Huh? Well, listen. I wanted you to have a taste of the pain I went through. I wanted you to have a taste of, of, of how it feels for a man to, to betray you. So because you have a man, you think you're perfect? You think both of you are perfect human beings? Oh, Tacha, I was supposed to be your friend, right? And you were supposed to console me at every given grieving moment. But what did you do? You were callousing, flaunting your husband's perfection in my eyes. What are you talking about? <laughs> okay. Let me jog your memory. Let me help you remember. Tacha, on my supposed wedding day, when you came to my house, after my ex dumped me at the altar, what did you do? Hmm? You came to my house. Instead of you to console me, you told me to get a man like Davis. And then I accepted. So what's this drama all about? Oh, huh? God. Jessica, you are unbelievable. Babe, you know what? Let's get out of here. Huh? Jessica. Let's get out of here. Get out of my house! Would you shut up? Get out! We're leaving already. Get out! Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Nonsense! Get out! Get out of my house! Even men that they think now want to talk! Even you that she gives morning in the morning, afternoon, evening, you want to talk! You want to talk? You want to talk? Nonsense! Rubbish! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for doubting you. I'm so sorry for letting Jessica manipulate me. Well, it's all good. At least I'm glad nothing wrong happened, eventually. Thank you for staying through. I love you. I love you too, baby. Oh. That must be Bobby. I didn't tell me he was coming. Babe, I'll, yeah. I'll see you, eh? G! Bobby, what's up? How far now? I'm good, man. Um, uh, Madame is inside. <laughs> Bruh, 
I just I just got out of hot seats, real hot seats. Thank God I didn't get burnt. What are you talking about? Jessica. Mm. My wife eventually found out. My wife caught her red-handed. How did you do that guy? Well, I told her about it. And for the first time, she gave me listening ears without acting naive. Then she asked me to play along, which I gave her a show. So, where, the whole story. Wait, so where's Jessica now? She's got her house now. I personally will pack her things and send her across through a dispatch or something. Well, that sounds, sounds like good news to me anyway. Good news to you? Yes. How exactly? Because now I will have attention, you know, 100%. <laughs> like, chill, chill. What exactly are you... What's your mission here? Do you really love this girl for real? You won't just tap in and tap out and wipe your mouth with, with wipes or servet or something? Well, for now, I don't know. I really don't know for now, but I just want to see her first. You don't know. You just want to see her first. Yes. Then we'll see what happens. All right. Okay, so can I have a number? You want to have a number? Of course. Fine. But guy, or you're for you. Oh, God. Stop don't me. come back and be telling me that. Oh, girl, send number to me. Don't worry about it, okay? Number you want. Number you should yeah. get. So are we going in or... Uh. Do not adorn to your past It will do nothing good at all For you If only you could see The harm it will cause you Hello? Hello, Jesse. It's Bobby Huh? Yes, Bobby, Davis' friend. <sighs> I am single, and I am going to be fulfilled. I don't need a man, and this is not a lie. I am telling myself nothing but the truth. After all this, not everyone that is married that is happy. We are all faking it and I can never live in lies. I would rather accept my truth. I love being single, full of enjoyment and stress free. Miss Fina, I'm I know, Fina. Right? You know me, I'm not big on, I'm not big on filters. <laughs> What are you trying to say? <laughs> baby. Yeah, babe. There's something I'll, I'd like us to talk about. And I need you to be very honest with me. Okay. What is it? It's about our childlessness. Hey. Look, I think it's high time we got a sperm donor. We need to have a child or children, anyone. Okay. Babe, we should do this. I'm sure you don't want to be changing diapers at old age. You're not getting younger. Mm -hmm. Neither am I. Sure. Well, I'm ready if you're ready. Yeah, I am. Let's go to the hospital tomorrow. Okay, we can go during lunch break. Is that okay? Sure. Okay, thank you. Hello, Jesse. Hello. It's me, Bobby, David's friend. <gasps> oh, yes. Bobby, Bobby, yeah. Bobby, Bobby. Uh, where is Davis? Oh, you hardly find David outside. Um, yeah, you hardly find him. You know he's a married man. Yeah, okay. But you don't look. You look tipsy. Okay. You don't mind if I just ride with you so I can just yeah, take okay. you home? I'm okay. I'm okay. just waiting for this waiter to just oh. come. So you don't look stable. Well, I'm okay, so I'll just be going. When the waiter needs his money, he will come. Okay. So. Are you sure you don't need help? I'm fine. But you don't look... I'm fine. You don't I'm look fine. stable. Yes, I'm fine. Okay, okay, easy, easy, okay, easy, easy, okay, easy. okay. Okay. You know what, just okay. don't hurt yourself. I, I, okay? I think I need the help. Okay, just up a little bit. 
A little bit. All right, all right. Okay. I'll take care of the bills, okay? All right, all right. All right, all right. Okay. All right. Yeah. How do I approach my boss? How do I tell him that I need a leave? So I can just focus on getting pregnant. Do I call manager? I think I should call manager. Let me call him and ask for his advice. <sighs> Hello manager. Yes, I'm fine. I'm very well. Thank you. How are you? I, okay, quick one. I'm calling to make inquiries about application for relief. But first of all, am I due for relief? Oh, I am? Okay. Okay, okay, no problems. I'll just work on my letter right now. All right, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That babe at the lounge last night. Which babe? Jessica now. Jessica. Bro, that babe is so fine. What? I mean, I really like that girl. Though. I'm trying to see if I can just walk things out with that girl. For real. Telling me. Bro, the same Jessica I've been telling you about. What's your problem? Guy, look, I don't want to have anything to do with that girl. She's a, she's a very wicked person. So if you want to do anything with her, just know that I'm not involved. See, guy, you just keep reminding me of this thing, guy. Don't worry. See, you're beginning to sound like you have been petty. You don't be big now, guy. Baba, ha. listen, I'm trying to advise you here. Jessica is a bad girl. She don't be a better person. If you want to go ahead and marry her, all you're for you, now you sabi, but don't just involve me. You understand? Oh, forget about me, guy. See, man, I like that baby. Don't worry. <laughs> Let's just see how things go. Don't worry. Why am I so unlucky with men? Damien tricked me and eloped with another woman. Davis tricked me and set me up against my best friend. Where and when on this planet Earth am I going to find my own man? A man that will love me for real and choose me over every other woman. to do. I am going to keep Bobby really close. Yes. From Bobby, I can get Davis. And finally getting him to live with me. Then we have no choice than to keep running back because he will want more. Hmm. I'm going to give Bobby a chance because of Davies. Honestly, that's how you know a real carburetor. Yeah, you remember the, the other guy I bought my car from? Uh, my first car. Hi! Hi, Davies. What's up with you? Now? I'm good. I'm good. I'm fine. Guy, I'm out of here. Guy. Where are you going to? Guy! What's up with you now? Where did you go? Um, just give me a You're going? No, just a second. I'll be right back. I'll be right back, okay? Guys!
Devi is... De Devi is gone. What do you want? What's your problem? Why are you behaving like this? Why are you behaving like this seeing me and Bobby together? Huh? Or is this jealousy I'm smelling? Now, Jessica, you are not smelling anything. You don't even know what you're smelling. Maybe it's fat you're smelling. Why should I be there? I don't have any business with you now. You know what? I'm explaining too much. But, but we're not done talking. God. We're, we're not done. Jesse. <laughs> Look, I don't care what has happened between you and Davis in the past, but I just think those ones are just behind us right now. Look, I'm willing to build something strong with you. Something really serious. I'm being honest. Something like what? Something like a committed relationship that will lead to marriage. Marriage? Yes. <sighs> well, Bobby, um, I'm sorry, but I'm not interested. Um, I don't know how to say this politely, but if you're not my spec, I... I mean, I can't even spend a night in your arm, not to talk of my lifetime, so... I'm sorry, honestly. Look, I, I, I can do anything you want me to do for you. Look, I can work on myself to fit into that man that you... That you want. Please don't turn me down. Please. No, I'm not interested. I'm not. Please, just this one chance. Please. I beg you. Please. Okay. Um, all right. Oh, but then I'll manage you. Yes. I'll have to manage you. Like I said, you're not my spec and I'm not going to force things. So I'll manage you. Hey, baby. Sugar. Hey, sugar. What's up? Hey, my love. My baby. You and this your online business. Hey, wait, wait. There's high volatility of the market now, so you can't <laughs> jump on it. What does that even mean? <laughs> I'll tell you later. <clears throat> baby. Hey, wait. I'm coming. Wait. Guess what? What? Just guess. My mind is on this. Okay. Okay, you heard about the high volatility. <laughs> I don't care about that. Just guess, babe. Sorry, please now guess. Just say something. It's right. boron. <clears throat> what does that mean? <laughs> but, oh. I'm pregnant. <laughs> Did you scream like that? You what? I'm three weeks gone. <laughs> God, baby, you're, you're, baby. Playing, you're playing with me. No, I'm not. God, you're gonna be in that. No, babe, come down, come down, come down, come down. Oh my God, you're going to be in that. We got a party, baby. We got a party. We're having a baby. Yes, we're having a baby. Yes, we're having a baby. His name is going to be. What was his name going to be? I don't know anything. I can't think of anything right now. I'm just listen, so excited. Listen, listen, Davis, Davis. Davis. She's a girl. Um, <laughs> Tasha. <laughs> oh, Gedoni. Yeah. I'm coming. That's my birthday girl. But I told you to get dressed. I want to take you around town and I show you how to oh. go time. Yeah, you said that. Here, I got you this. You can check it out. <gasps> you got me a dress? Yeah, 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 I just wanted you to use it, you know, for your birthday outing. Do you understand? 
No one has ever given me a gift. Oh, come on. Come yes, on. not even my ex. I did everything for. Oh, you deserve more. You deserve a lot more. Baby, I love you so much. And I'm willing to do anything to make you happy. I'm willing to wipe those ugly experiences you've had in the past out of your mind. Just give me a chance, okay? <laughs> right, thank you, Bobby. I appreciate it. <laughs> so go get dressed, let's go. Alright, okay. I'll be right back. Okay, okay. Do not return to your past. It will do nothing good at all. For you. I'm coming. Even you could see. You must be so shameless to show your face here after everything you did. Tasha, I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. I... It was the devil. The devil? You're sorry? Jessica, you're my best friend. If I did something or I said something you were not okay with, you should have just told me and I would apologize. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, Steve is home, so I will apologize soon too. He's not home. He went to the supermarket. Is it what I'm thinking? Yes, it's what you're thinking. <gasps> I'm pregnant, we, we got a donor. This is wonderful! So I'm gonna be a godmother. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god, I'm so happy for you. Thank you I'm so sorry. much. I'm sorry. So how about you and Bobby? Are you guys an item now? What's going on? Well, um, yes. And I must say, Bobby has such a beautiful soul. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I was wondering if I had met him earlier. Bobby is such an amazing person. You just have to calm down and get to know him yeah, properly. I'll try. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Are you tearing up? Oh, <laughs> Do you want something to eat? Sure. Sure. <laughs> you came to my house to eat. Okay, let's. Jessica, your friend, I don't know what she's saying. She's she's in some sort of distress. She said I should come over and help her. Baby, mm. do you even hear what I'm saying? I should go. Jessica, what did you say is wrong with you? Nothing is wrong with you now. Um, well, I'm sick. My back hurts, my waist, my leg hurts, my head everywhere, my body everywhere hurts. Jessica, you are at it again. 
Why would you just stop this madness? I, I thought you were done with this what madness. What do you mean by I'm at it again? Like, what is wrong with you? I'm trying to understand what is wrong with you. Listen, I want you. And I know you want me to. So why the pretense? Why can't we just forget about this and let's get down already? You know what? You're out of your mind. I'm out of this place. If you walk past that door. Uh -huh. If I walk past the wall. If happened? you walk past that door. I'm going to kill myself. Yes, thank God. My security saw you walk into this house. So automatically, you become guilty of a crime that I don't know how it will end yet. Jessica, come on. What's this BS? Stop, stop already. Please, don't do this. Please, just drop the knife. Don't, don't, don't do this, it's madness. I love my wife, I can't have anything to do with you. Oh, don't you get it? Um, okay, okay. I want you. I hope you're not going to keep blackmailing me with that knife. Oh no, oh no, that's not me. Just come here. Wait, hold up, hold up. Chill. 30 minutes. I'm just going to stay around you. I'm not going to do anything. Just 30 minutes. One hour. What exactly? Cuddling. Stay yes, together. Yes, one hour. We can cuddle, um, watch some movies, talk, you know, just spend time together. Mm. Mm -hmm. I want you so bad. Just wait, hold up. Okay. Jessica? Well, your husband is lying on my bed right now. Do you want photos or videos? Or would you just switch to video call so you can see for yourself?
How could you? What took you to her house? So you wanted to sleep with her all this while and you just kept pretending? Come on, that's not true. Babe, look, let's not fall for this. This is what she wants. She wants to break our home because of our envy. Don't let this happen. How am I sure you're not lying? Babe, I am sorry. She deceived me. She deceived us. I won't let this kind of a thing ever happen again. Please forgive me for the sake of our baby at least. Please. 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 Don't let her win. It's fine. I was just I was mad because she didn't tell me. She just left. I didn't tell you. Come on, baby. I, I told you well, the one that asked me to go. Have you forgotten? I did. If I had known you were not even conscious, so conscious, if I if I'd known you were sleepy, I wouldn't have gone. You, you said I should go. You, you said it. Why would I have gone there in the first place without telling you? Am I mad? Jessica, she is evil. I would never have anything, anything to do with Jessica ever again. She's so evil. How did I know that girl? I'm sorry. How did I ever meet her? I'm sorry, baby. I'm so sorry for everything. I'll be careful. You know, Davis warned me about having anything to do with you. But I didn't listen. I was willing to help you and make you happy. I was willing to give you a chance to be happy. But of course you had your plans. Thank you very much. I'm sorry. Thank you. I'm sorry. I don't Thank I don't you. know what came over me. It was the devil. I promise never to go close to Davis again. I'm sorry. So you're trying to tell me to forgive you? Yes. You must be joking to think that I'll forgive you after what you just did. I, I don't want to ever set my eyes on you again. I'm sorry. Blood sucking demon. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Doing here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, who's that? I'm sorry. What are you doing here? Do you know what, Jessica? Do you know the energy you put in destroying my home? If you had channeled that energy to yourself, you'd be the most successful woman on earth. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Listen, listen. Tasha and I. We don't want you around here anymore. Okay? <laughs> just, just go. Just go. Enjoy your life so we can have peace of mind. So, okay, this is not worth it, okay? I'm sorry. Let's I don't want to come here. I So 